Now, the micro, small and medium enterprises are set to continue enjoying free bank to mobile transactions from I&M Bank. This follows a move by the lender to extend the waiver on such transactions to enable businesses reduce their operational cost and attract new customers. The bank, which is now eyeing a share of the retail market, notes that transaction cost has been a burden to players in the MSME sector, eating into their already low margins. Jimmy Bogo with the details. Speaking during the launch of the Nisare Kabisa campaign, INDM officials intimated their aggressive plan to increase their customer base to over 1 million by 2026. According to the lender, retail banking in the country provides them with an opportunity for growth, an opportunity that the lender now seeks to tap into with a 10 billion credit facility set to be rolled out to SMEs in unsecured loans of up to 5 million shillings. To further attract customers, the bank has waived the certificate such fees while promising the sector access to working capital. For LPU financing, uh, remember our, our threshold for unsecured lending for MSMEs is 5 million shillings. So if you came to us with an LPO, let's say your LPO is uh, worth 7 million, the maximum we finance as a bank is 70%, 70% of the value of the LPO. If it's invoice discounting, uh, remember invoice discounting, you've already done the work and you, you've invoiced and you're waiting to be paid. We finance you up to 80%. For this particular segment, because the the annual turnover is about to, up to 50 million, uh, then it, you know a 5 million loan basically is more than sufficient from what we've seen. We're, we're basically looking to, to disburse at least about 10 billion under this space in the next uh, year. The Kenya Association of Manufacturers has also lauded the move, noting that it will unlock the manufacturing potential through availing capital for SMEs to scale up manufacturing. A lot of uh, uh, SMEs in manufacturing sector work with very many farmers and they prefer to pay them via M-Pesa. So they are paying their services across the supply chain via M-Pesa and when you look at per person costs, it's extremely high. So when you do what you have done now, it's really transformational to the cost of an SME in engaging uh, their value chains. Father, the bank says it will be keen on SMEs in general trade, which have a high and regular capital needs. By removing the bank to mobile transaction cost, INM Bank is hopeful that this will help SMEs conserve capital and in turn reinvest in the business, creating more job opportunities. Jimmy Mbogo, Citizen TV, Nairobi.